to the next session of differential equation. Now we study the solution of differential equation. The fourth type is the linear differential equation. What is the linear di differential equation? A differential equation is said to be linear if the dependent variable derivatives should be of first degree only and there should be no product of them. Means it should be y having degree 1 dy by dx having degree 1 d square y by dx square having degree 1. So this is called linear differential equation. But it should not be should not be y dy by dx or d square y by dx square into d raised to 4 y by dx square anything means they don't require product when we have differential equation with a degree 1 then this equation is called linear differential equation now we study how to find this solution of linear differential equation and which are the linear differential equation so first linear in y and linear in x we have linear in y and linear in x so it's dy by dx plus py equal to q so in this p and q are the function of x or constant anything these are the function of x or constant and here we having dx by dy plus px equal to q means in place of y it having x and in place of x it having y so it's linear in x or y to find the solution of this equation we find the integrating factor so that integrating factor will be e raised to e raised to p dx e raised to p dx and here the integrating factor will be e raised to p dy and the, our final solution will be y integrating factor equal to integration of q integrating factor dx plus c this is the solution of linear differential equation in y and the uh, linear differential equation in x they having solution x integrating factor equal to q into integrating factor dy plus c so this is the solution when the equation linear in x and this is the solution when the li equation linear in y I show you with the help of example so our first example will be x cos x dy by dx plus y x sin x plus cos x equal to 1 now this equation not in our linear form so we have to make it linear form the linear form will be dy by dx equal to dy by dx plus px equal to q so p is the function of x or y and q is function of only x this is our linear differential equation so this doesn't look like a, a linear differential equation so we have to make this equation to the linear differential equation for that we have to remove this one 
this term x cos x so we divide throughout by x cos x now our equation becomes y here it gets sin x sin x plus cos x divided by x cos x 1 upon x cos x so till now it having some difficulty so we try to reduce that one dy by dx plus y we separate it it becomes x x is cancel even tan x plus 1 by x equal to 1 by x cos x uh, i'm sorry about this it having y here so we have y like this and dy by dx plus equal to q so it having function of only x and this is the function of x so this is our p this is our q so our first step is to find to find the integrating factor that will be integrating factor so integrating factor will be it is to integrate p dx so e raised to integrating p so what is the value of p it's tan x plus 1 by x so tan x plus 1 by x divide uh, into dx so integration of tan x what is the integration of tan x it's a log of sec x plus 1 by x integration will be log x now log plus log means log a plus log b gives you log ab so our integrating factor will be log x sec x but when we have e raised to log so that term come in front side so our final will be x sec x so this is our integrating factor now we find the solution of this equation the solution will be y integrating factor equal to integration of q integrating factor dx plus c now our y as it is integrating factor it's x cos x x sec x so it x sec x equal to integration q what is the value of q that will be 1 upon x cos x and integrating factor of this x sec x dx plus c now this x and this x get cancelled 1 by cos means sec so we can write as x y x sec x equal to integration of sec square x dx plus c so integration of sec square x will be it's a tan x plus c so this is our linear differential equation solution